I deal with banks. In fact, I think it's uh, not only beyond a reasonable doubt. Oswald was firing, and Oswald was firing to hit. That I consider to be a fact. The evidence is strong, but not quite as strong, that he was the only person firing and firing to hit. Were, was there anybody else firing? I know of no persuasive evidence or testimony uh, that would lead one to a conclusion that yes, it was somebody else firing. I will say this, if anybody else was firing, that somebody was to, in the left quadrant, if you will, looking toward the assassination, not in the right quadrant, for a lot of reasons, was, where did the bullets go? But Oswald was firing, probably firing alone. Uh, was there anybody else involved with him? Anybody who motivated him, put him up to a conspiracy? As one who's run two independent investigations for CBS News, spent more of CBS News's money and time and effort, would be the biggest story I could ever uncover if I could uncover some real evidence of a conspiracy or, well, two people would be a conspiracy, somebody else putting them to it. It isn't there. Will it ever be there? Will anybody ever uncover it? Can't say. So in answer to your question, the best available evidence and testimony is Oswald was definitely firing and firing to hit. Probably was Oswald alone, and probably wasn't anybody else involved. Will we ever, will we ever know for sure? No.